Yo, what's going on guys, it's the Gaming Pickle here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to build this really cool slime block elevator. It's um, an updated version of the one I made a video on before, made by Mr. Crayfish, um, but I think this one's a lot better, and it definitely has a lot more space in it. It has it's a it's a two by two area in there, so like it's a it's a yeah it's definitely a lot bigger than the one I made a video on before, which is um a one by one. But um, and this one just looks a lot cleaner anyway. Um now I I did forget who made this, so if any of you guys know, please leave a comment so I can actually cre credit the creator because I built this ages ago and I just decided I make a video on it now since um it, it's a good update so. And by the way, I'm playing this in 1.14, but it works in 1.14.1, uh, the newest release at the time of this video. So don't worry about that, it does work. And yeah, so um, let's get straight into building it, guys. Alrighty, so what you'll need is a 3x2 area right here. Don't worry about the orange, just the um, outside area of it. But this yellow, just worry about this yellow. And to start off, you'll need a 6 high. Yeah, six high um, space. So basically, just dig. If you're building this on ground level, dig six into the ground uh, with a three by two area uh, to build the machine in, which is over there. I've built the shaft already because that part takes um, a, a bit of a, a bit of a second, we'll say. Um, yeah, this and you guys probably don't want to see that anyway. It's nothing really too difficult. It's just glass, a few lights, and terracotta. Now, an important thing here for the shaft before you go and build this, um, build it out of an, a non movable block. Terracotta, I love to use terracotta for these elevators. One, because it doesn't move when it slime blocks um, come in contact with it, um, and they look really nice. Like, instead of like um, having the whole shaft made out of obsidian or furnaces, which I've seen a lot of elevators that look like that, and this does not look good. But now, since terracotta got added, um, looks way better. So make sure you do that. I um, mean, this glass doesn't matter; uh, it doesn't get touched by slime, so don't worry about that. Um, anyway, coming down to here, what you'll need to start off with to build the machines, you'll need obsidian, sticky piston, redstone repeater, redstone dust, slime block, powered rail, observer. Um, wool of your choice and the carpet of your choice so to get started what you want to do guys is grab that wool of choice place two right here now this is the front of your elevator so this is where you um, enter so be wary of that then over here back right place an obsidian block just like that then what you want to do um, is grab an observer place it facing outwards to the towards the back of your elevator then come back over here, place a redstone repeater facing to the right side of your elevator, place that on four ticks, then grab a redstone dust and just place it right behind that repeater. Then what you want to do, grab an observer and place it right up against that repeater just like that, crouch so you can do that. Then place a slime block there, another slime block there, then grab your sticky piston, place one on top of that slime block. Then place one facing downwards on top of this slime block. And then grab two more slime blocks, place that on top. Grab another stick, sticky piston, yeah, um, and place it right on top facing upwards on that right side or the left side, depends on what side you're building from. Then grab your wall of choice again, place it right on top of that redstone right there. Grab a powered rail, place it right there. Um, then grab an observer and place it facing towards this slime block right here. So all these observers should look like this, uh, with that little angry face facing towards the entrance. Um, and then, yeah, that, that, that means you've done it right. Then what you want to do is grab an, another observer. Oh, I've already got it equipped. Um, place a random block there, doesn't really matter. Then, because you're going to break it right there anyway. Um, then grab a sticky piston again, facing downwards on that observer right there. Then what you want to do is grab another observer, 
place it facing downwards. That's not downwards. Downwards. Um, so angry face is facing up. Um, you want to have it like that. Um, actually, before you do that, grab your redstone lamps, actually. Destroy that. Place the redstone lamp. Then do the observer, otherwise it will send a tick through and then your machine will be gone. Um, so yeah, definitely don't do that. Put the observer down after the redstone lamp. Alright. Then what you want to do is just grab slime blocks. Place two on top of that sticky piston. And then grab your wool of choice again. Um, place two right there and grab your carpet of choice and place the carpet right on top. Just like that. Now, for the next part of uh, this build, so we've just built this, um, so just make sure, go, fly around it a bit, make sure it looks exactly like how mine does, just like this, and then, once that's all good to go, what you want to do is come back up here, and for the next section, what you'll need is the shaft building stuff which is up here so you'll need a sea lantern grey stained glass i mean well any stained glass or any white to be completely honest uh any terracotta or irremovable i mean non-movable block uh the redstone lamp which we've already done so you should already have that so it doesn't matter um a button of choice and whatever you want this like wall block to be so i just chose smooth quartz in this case so what you want to do is this um, around the machine just do two here, two at the back, two at the up left side and then put this like wall block all the way up just like this. Um, you can place lanterns pretty much wherever you want. I just place them like, at the side of the glass, middle of the glass and at the top of the glass. And then fill in this area here with all the glass and then your shaft should be made. And then grab that button, place it right there on top of that lamp and you should be good to go now what you want to do come all the way up to the top of your elevator doesn't matter how high it is by the way just thought I mentioned that um, you can have this like going up to any height you want um, and back down to any uh, at, back down so um, it doesn't really matter now what you want to do from here is actually just grab that button again uh, place it right here on the left um, block of choice right there at the back um, in my case, it's smooth quartz again. Now what you want to do is grab all this stuff here. So, normal piston, block of redstone, slime block again, um, wall of choice again, redstone repeater again, smooth uh, quartz slab, doesn't matter what slab you use, um, and a powered rail. So you want to grab all that stuff. And to get started, what you want to do is just where you place your button, which should, should be this block, come one underneath and place two slabs out and grab that redstone, which I forgot. Um, place two redstones on top of it. Come down, place a normal piston just underneath this last slab there. Then grab your terracotta, which I also forgot to grab. Oh, it doesn't matter what block you actually place here, but place it right there with a repeater facing towards the shaft on one tick, I think. Yeah, one tick. Um, so just leave it normally. I mean, leave it how it's placed. Jeez, I can't talk. Okay. Um, then place the redstone block right there. Then you want three um, slime blocks. underneath then a piston facing upwards to those slime blocks then you want your wool right there just like this grab your rail bam place it there grab your redstone place it right there and then grab your sticky piston and place it right there and then your elevator should be done so if I just come on to here press this button you'll see the elevator climb up the shaft and stop right here and if I press this button okay guys I just realized 
this observer here is missing make sure you place it to the shaft I'm an idiot I can't believe I missed that to be completely honest like I've got the elevator right over there so I don't know what I was doing but um just let me fix this real quick yeah well mine's mine's broken now but don't don't make the same mistake I did and miss out that observer okay guys anyway I hope you guys have enjoyed this video again please leave a comment down below uh, to the creator of this elevator if you know who it is so I can credit them because like I said before I built this ages ago and I have no idea who built it and I did try and find an original video before I um, made this video but I just, I just didn't have any luck I spent about an hour actually looking for it so I have no idea if, if, where the video has gone but anyway I hope you guys enjoyed if you did enjoy and want to see more smash the like button and then if you want to see more, hit the subscribe button and hit the post notification bell right next to it so you don't miss an upload. This has been the Gaming Pickle. Peace. I see you never miss a shot. I feel like T Please dude, why you trying to front hold me? You see through I see you. Say you